and welcome to weekly vlog number four. I think it's number four. Um, I have been very busy this morning. It is still morning and I have been very busy. I have been making orders that I'm going to um, send off on Monday, which is tomorrow. Today is actually Sunday and I thought I would actually start these weekly vlogs on a Sunday because I like to get the kind of weekly vlog edited by Sunday morning so that I can get it kind of saved and scheduled ready for Monday. So I don't really tend to film much on Sunday. So I thought maybe if I start the video on Sunday, then that solves that issue. Um, but anyway, I am currently packaging orders. Somebody's order is in here. Basically, it is a charcoal clay face mask off of my Etsy and eBay that I handmade literally an hour ago. Um, I then wrap it in one of these little bags like that. eBay sent me a ton of stuff ages ago, so I've got loads of things like that. Um, and then also just some of this kind of like, not bubble wrap, but like, I don't know, something to keep it safe. Um, then a little note um, as well from to say thank you. And then I also popped in a little business card as well. And then because this is my charcoal clay face mask, I am popping in the information sheet, which gives all of the information about the product, like the benefits of it, how to use it and the ingredients. So yeah, and that's what an order, like a typical order looks like. So yeah, that person ordered my charcoal clay face mask. And then I also have somebody that ordered my peach lip gloss so um those are the both the things that i'm gonna have to send off tomorrow but um yeah so just in case you was wondering everything is linked in the description like if you ever want to buy anything from me and support my small little business then please do um just bear in mind that obviously because i have started my new job that i will be working like throughout the week so um if you're gonna order something i would recommend ordering it on like Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, um, so that it does get made on the weekend and posted on Monday. Um, but I will try my best to kind of um, sort something out when it comes to that. But anyway, I'm also wearing one of my best friend Emma's little scrunchies. If you watched last week's weekly vlog, so weekly vlog number three, you'll see that I bought a couple of scrunchies from her. She's recently started like a little small business and I think it's called Beeson's Bobbins so it's like a really cute name and um yeah this is the zebra printed one and the one that I showed you in last week's was like the red polka dot one so yeah I will also link her Instagram in the description if you want to go and check her out because honestly like these are such good quality and um and I'm comparing the quality of these to ones that I've had before and these are better so well done Emma. Like three weeks ago I had a spider and I called him Lucas He's still here. Oh yeah, she probably did a, a spider warning <laughs> for those people. But he's still here! And he's made a little web, but I'm too scared to get too close in case he just jumps at me. But yeah, he's still there. <laughs> what? No, I always like being involved when you stop filming. <laughs> Mom's picked me up. Yes. Oh, I, I just let you know um, I'm filming on Sundays now as the first day of the week because if I edit on a Sunday, that means that the first day like it because I edit on a Sunday morning that means I don't get to film Sundays okay. so I'm starting the vlogs on Sundays that makes sense I think we've been to the co-op I got this it's new um, Cadbury Caramilk I like Caramac so I thought I'd like this she actually forced me to buy myself one as well I didn't but she wanted to it's chilling over there it is chilling yeah so I thought I'd have it in the car and then I think Tommy's made homemade pizzas when we get back so it's I'll have that when I get back but Tommy knows but it's 20 to 8 so I'm quite hungry oh god yeah we're late again aren't we yeah right 30 minute drive everybody yeah let's go just got back Tommy and Dylan made this pizza for me homemade including the dough yeah boy. today is now Monday it is the start of the working week for me I'm back at work. This is gonna be my second um, second week at my new job. I got up at about quarter past, half past six. I've had my breakfast, I had an iced coffee. Um, I sat down just there and watched some YouTube on my laptop and um, yeah, got myself ready, did a little bit of makeup. I can't help myself. Um, a lot of people there don't wear makeup, but some of them do, um, but yeah. 
I just like to. Um, got Emma's little headband on, the red polka dot one, and then I've got kind of like some sports wear on and then this like nice warm jacket on because it's actually really cold today. Um, so yeah, this is what it's looking like. It looks kind of sunny, but it's actually quite cold, um, but I'm sure it'll warm up later on. He's awake. Right, we're back from work. I've got a face mask on. Didn't come back like this. We're home. Hey. At work, um, we was, well, Dylan and I don't know, some of the people there was like thrashing or threshing or whatever it's called, um, where you get like the barley and you put it in the machine to get off the seeds. And in like the box of barley that we needed to like basically like chop up, there was a mouse and Dylan was getting one of the bales out and the mouse shot at him and it literally hit him and flew at him um, and then bounced off and just ran away. So um, hopefully that doesn't happen again because apparently they kill the mice and I'd be like, no, I'm gonna take it home. So I'd have extra pets. Right, I need to crack on because my face mask is drying. It's 10 p.m. Mum's putting the washing out. Dylan's knickers. <laughs> I had a shower. Half watched Love Island. I just had it on in the background. I was playing on games on my phone. Um, oh, my bedroom's up there. Can you see it? Um, I'm going to sleep in a minute. So I thought I would say goodnight and see you on Tuesday, which is tomorrow, um, for another fun-filled day. <laughs> Look at all those lights. Mum, mm. you're like, because it's bright out there, you look just like dark and then it just looks like a silhouette. Oh, that suits. So I've got a bit of a glow on at the moment. You can't see it. Good. Ooh, Ooh. It. It's dark, everybody. Right, good night, everybody. Good night, everyone. Good night. It's now Tuesday. Don't think I videoed. Not sure. Mum, guess what this is, apart from poo. It looks horrific. It's gonna be pulled pork. But, look. Ooh. Suddenly you start ripping into it and it's looking good all of a sudden. Sorry. This has been cooking since, let's have a think. Really low and slow. This has been in the oven since about 11 o'clock this morning. Jesus. To be honest, it probably wants a little bit of moisture in it, but not much. How do you do that, add water? teeny tiny bit of water. Do you think it needs a bit of moisture? Because I don't want, because you're going to have it in a bun, you don't want all the juices dripping out. Um, well, if you wanted any moisture, they could just add a bit of ketchup. Uh, no doubt ketchup would be added. Um, I would recommend um, uh, raw red onion would be really nice with this. Nice texture and it uh, offsets the sweetness of the pulled pork. We're having it in one of these buns. And there's obviously, as you can tell, I'm not eating vegetarian most of the time whilst I'm here. We are career meat eaters. Deliver internationally. As well as being downright beautiful, the packaging is actually eco-friendly. So I'll give you guys a little close-up there. But is anyone else just so... Good morning. Today is Wednesday, halfway through the week. I'm sat in the conservatory waiting for everybody to get ready. I think Tommy's on the toilet. Bless him. And um, I'm currently editing my video that's gonna go up tomorrow, which is Thursday, but when you're watching this, it would have already gone up. Is that Dylan? I can hear some footsteps. Sounds like mum. Mum, is that you? I recognize those footsteps. I'm just talking to the camera. Oh, good morning, camera. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah. They can't. They can't see you. Um, yeah. Yesterday we spent half the day. Yeah. I don't think I videoed much yesterday. I think I videoed mum pulling some pork, and that was it. Um, yeah. We spent half the day in the field yesterday afternoon um, pulling out plants, which I like doing that because time goes by so much quicker, and also I like like more physical activity jobs than like just sitting there. Um, I think we're doing that today as well, so that's good. Um, do, you, do you want to film that damn squirrel that will not leave my flipping seed alone? There's that damn squirrel over there. Here he is. He's been on there about 15 minutes so far. Um, he even went on that bird feeder which is near the camera, the one with the green bits on it. Yeah. He was on there yesterday, I'll grease the pole now. 
There he Not is. that I don't want him to have food. Look how close the camera has gone to him. Look how strong his legs must be. I mean, he's clever stuff. I don't mind, I've accepted he will eat the seeds from that feeder, but I couldn't believe he got on the one that I got specifically for the birds. Thought there's no way he's getting up this. Look how zoomed in I am. Yeah. Well, Seriously, he's been in that position 15 to 20 minutes. God. What an idiot. He's gonna be fat. <laughs> right. I'll see you later on. Goodbye. Hello. Why don't you make your own hot chocolate? Hey boys. So it is, um, oh my God, it's hot chocolate. Got a spot on my face. I think that's blood. Um, great. Um, it's the um, end of, oh my God, is it just Wednesday? Oh my God, I think it's only just Wednesday. Oh my God, I feel like I've been at work all week. We've got Thursday tomorrow and we've got Friday. Me and Tommy and Dylan stayed behind, did some overtime in the fields um, to get a few things done. I think we're going back into the field um, again tomorrow with work and I'll let you know, you know. And um, I think that's about it really. Quite tired, we've got my first pay slip today for work. So get my money soon, which is good, which is very, very good. Um, and, um, and it's quite funny because I earn double what Dylan earns because he's 17 and I'm 21, which, and we're doing the exact same job, which I just find absolutely hilarious. Um, how like two people can do the exact same jobs and one be paid double the other. But anyway, um, the lawnmower's outside. You see like a red flash, that's the lawnmower by himself. He scared me like half an hour ago because I just heard this like loud bang. And yeah, he was out the window basically saying hello. Um, so yeah, mum got anything to say? Not really, no. It was dad's birthday yesterday. They went out for a meal. Oh yeah, that was nice. My mum was 70 yesterday. Who really? And Georgie's dad was 52. 52? 52. I thought dad was like 56. No. Oh my god, I literally could have... I literally could have sworn he was like 56. He's not, no, he's 52. Oh wow, he's actually quite young then. Oh, <laughs> I don't get it. You never know how old me and dad are. Hang on, let me guess you. Well, oh. if he's 50, what is he, 52, then you must be 48, 48? <laughs> Girl with your instinct. 48? He was going to say 47. Yeah, no, but 48 was my first instinct, and then oh, I thought, okay, yeah. No, 47. She's 47, everybody. Can't see me, just see. I remember when I was little and my parents were in their 30s. What? When you were little, I was still in my 20s. You were, I was 25 when you were born. Yeah, but I just remember when you was, like, when you was in your 30s and I was, like, yeah. Just above. You know. Dad was 30 when you were born. Good night everybody, see you tomorrow. Sleep well. Good morning, welcome to Thursday. So it's basically second to last day of work today. It's half past seven right now. I've been up since half past six. I've had my breakfast, I had a coffee and got dressed and did a little bit of makeup. And basically I'm now gonna get a few things done. I feel so much more productive in the morning than I do in the afternoon, especially when I'm back from work. Like I'll have a list of things I wanna get done and I won't be able to get them done because I'm so tired. But in the morning, I've had my coffee, I'm ready to go. So I'm gonna edit some of my video, um, my empties video, which I wanted to go on Thursday, which is today, but I don't think I'll be able to because the Wi-Fi here, um, it will take me a couple of hours to just upload the video. So it might be like Friday. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna edit that. I'm then gonna accept my offer for a master's because I still haven't done that oopsies so i need to do that because i want to do a master's next year and they gave me an offer based on my results so yeah i i basically can I can do a master's and um what else do i need to do i need to apply for student finance and sort out stuff to do with my youtube taxes or something so i've got quite a few things to do i won't do the tax youtube thing this morning but i'm going to try and do all of the rest um so yeah a bright early morning. This is what the outside is looking like.
I'm back home now. Had a full day of work, um, took my makeup off, tidied up my hair, got my pyjamas on. Um, basically, today I was out in the field again. However, they let me drive in the field. Now I can't drive yet, as you probably know. I know how to drive, but I haven't passed my test. Um, I can't park or anything like that. Like I just know how to set off and keep going and you know stop and then turn, that kind of thing. But actual like maneuvers, like parking, I can't you know do necessarily yet but they let me drive in the fields and I drove in like a, the company car to like transport people into different fields because from field to field it's quite a long wait like it will take like 10-15 minutes just to walk to an area and like it just wastes time and we was in a group of people and no one could drive like officially and I said I can drive but I haven't passed my test and they said that's fine we're just in a field so I drove for the first time in a year I stalled the car once when I set off because I haven't driven in ages and also it's a new car like I needed to kind of get used to it and then I was absolutely fine and then later on I drove in like this pickup truck thing um, which was quite weird because it was like a truck that I've never driven a truck before um, in the fields over the hay well not hay over the barley um, and yeah that was cool to kind of get used to that I accidentally left the handbrake on um when i tried to set off but it's all good you know we solved that problem um but yeah so hopefully with the money i'm earning from this job i can save up for driving lessons and my driving test and my theory so that i can actually officially drive because that would just be so much easier to be able to drive places instead of have to rely on people for lifts so yeah there we go um Surprisingly, I've got more energy than I normally do after work, which I found that that was the case last week at sort of this time of the week as well. Monday was my tiredest day, um, but yeah, um, we had a good day and um, Dylan managed to spill his like his coffee all over him. I'll try and insert a picture now so that you can see that. That was quite funny. Um, he just tends to do that, you know, um, and I think that's pretty much all I can update you on, to be honest, um, but yeah. That was everything from today. Oh, hey, Tommy. Look at Tommy's bedroom. This is Tommy's bedroom, everybody. Enjoy. Oh hi, I didn't see you there. Oh hello. How long till um <laughs> got that tea. in the oven? Um, I'm gonna say thirty minutes because I'm just about to make some dumplings. How close are you? Uh -huh. <laughs> sure gotta get them wrinkles. <laughs> gotta get them wrinkles. That was so near I couldn't focus. <laughs> yeah. Just added some courgettes in at the 11th hour, otherwise they would have mushed up. And I'm just going to put some, I'm just about to make some dumplings. I've got my mixer, I just need to have Ooh, dumplings. So yeah, you can't have beef stew and not have dumplings. Yes, it's the summertime, but it doesn't matter, does it? What's the rhubarb for? Rhubarb, I'm just going to roast it and put it in the freezer, ready to make a crumble at some future date. Not today? Not today. Oh, no time. No crumble today. I'll have to make one for next week. Is ah, that okay? No. But I'm having to sit it there because I can't fit it in the oven with that massive pan, which is annoying. I'm not putting another oven on. So. Oh, have you caught any flies? Oh my god, you caught a fly. Have I? Yeah, here. Oh, got one. Why is that exciting, poor thing? I'm <laughs> sorry, fly. No, I've hoovered up about 30, 40 flies from the floor of the conservatory, so maybe I should have hung that in there. Probably. The thing is, I'm usually still here cooking and uh, the flies are at me all the time, so I hung it there. I didn't have more. So. Does everybody like the card I got Dad for his birthday? Uh, <laughs> I quite like that card on there saying, there's no money in this card, I'm not your grandma. <laughs> yeah, Dad's birthday cards. Mum would like me to film um, the dumps. The unveiling. The dumps? Yep, the dumplings. That does not make it sound very tasty. It's raining outside. It is. Tonight. That means that goddamn grass is going to need cutting. So what's going on with these dumps? The dumps. They're not just any dumps. 
their special dumps in that they've got parmesan in them. Ooh! Lives. Yeah. You ready for the... Oh, oh there they are in the stew. Are. Cooking away. I hope they're cooked in the middle. You guys? Are you cooked? Oh, steam glasses. Well, if not, then we'll just eat yeah. them anyway. Yeah. You can't beat a bit of starch. That's it. I've literally fingered up every single one. <laughs> Your hands are clean though, aren't they, Mum? Yeah, they were this morning. Shh. She's joking, guys. I am joking. Just, just Constantly washing my hands. Swiss roll for afters. <laughs> Look how tiny it is. Oh my <laughs> god. I mean, come on, we're adults. That's just for like a that just that's a mini roll. That's a literal. I'm thug. sorry. That is a mini roll. <laughs> mini roll. Oh god, what is that? Tennis ball. <gasps> Ew. Ew. Oh. Hello. It's Friday. Actually, is it Friday? Yes, it's Friday. Um, welcome to day number whatever we're on. Um, oh, are you trying to get in? We're about to go to McDonald's. Mum's taking me home for the weekend to my flat. I'm gonna go to McDonald's. Um, oh, hey. So yeah. <laughs> Tommy, don't hey, you keep cutting my head out. It's a joke, Jordy. Relax. Where's Mum? There we are. Uh, yeah, we're off to McDonald's now, <laughs> which is like half an hour away. Them two are coming on a road trip. Go and get some cheese bites. Cheese balls. We had a fun day at work. Good. Found a dead mouse. Put 20 quid in the kitty for you, lots of awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, you Yummy. Um, so I need to get my things together. Off back to my flat, do some cleaning. Might have a barbecue on the weekend, which you'll see. Um, good day at work, but it was a very long day. It felt really long. Don't know why. It just felt extra long today. And couldn't really be bothered for the rest of the day. Literally the last half an hour I was like, um, Dylan, shall we play Would You Rather? Um, so yeah. But we're gonna go in the car now, so I should probably say goodbye for now. In the car. Dylan's in the back. Hello. So long till we see you again. Little house. Third point. Bye bye now. Well, you know. Just he's just like, uh, yeah, whatever. He doesn't know he's being filmed. <laughs> what has he found? A poop? Oh, oh, it was an issue, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's looking at my extremely bold tyre. Bye bye now. <laughs> bye. Buy my car that's broken down. Your car? My car. What do you mean, your car? What do you mean? Mint Neil. Little journey till we get Mint there. McMars. <laughs> Just got back to my flat, got my McDonald's. I got a barbecue quarter pounder. Um, I also got some fries and this drink, and then I got some cheese bites because I love cheese bites. And then I did get a Mars, like a Mars bar McFlurry. So yeah. Okay, so today is actually Saturday. I haven't filmed anything today, and it's now about eight o'clock. All I've done today is cleaning. I'm back at my flat. I have cleaned my toilet. I've cleaned the bathroom sink. And that doesn't, you know, that's not a quick job for me. I like to spend some time on it. And yeah, I'm very happy with how it's looking. I put some Zaflora in a bowl and cleaned all the surfaces in my flat and everything. And I also still need to hoover. So hopefully I'll have time for that. I also want to do a workout still today. So yeah, hopefully I've also got time for that. Um, but yeah, I had a little shower earlier, plaited my hair. Saturdays and Sundays are kind of like my pamper days where I will like just kind of trim up my brows a little bit, which is what I did today. I did some facial cupping with some kind of like oil and things like that, which I really like facial cupping. I do see lots of benefits from it. I also do a hair mask and a face mask. I will insert a picture of what I look like with a face mask on. I use my charcoal clay face mask which is what I make and sell on my eBay and Etsy which is always linked in the description if you was wondering but I popped that on and yeah love that mask it is my favorite I've had a fairly fairly busy but also kind of relaxed day I haven't filmed anything today because I just completely forgot about the weekly vlog so I do apologize but I thought that I would just end it here because it is like a Saturday night there's nothing else really I'm gonna film next week I'm gonna do my skincare routine in next week's weekly vlog or the next video that you're gonna see after this one is on Thursday 
probably like 5 p.m or something like that and it's going to be an empties video wanted to get that video up this week but didn't get around to it so that'll go up next week instead um or when you're watching this on thursday and then next monday is going to be weekly vlog number five where you're going to see me do my skincare routine because a couple of people asked me for my skincare routine so that is coming your way um but thanks for watching this week i hope you enjoyed it please give the video a thumbs up if you did and subscribe i post a weekly vlog every single monday and then another random video on a thursday so um stick around um but i will see you on thursday for an empty video. Goodbye.